Another big thing in the sort of smart home uh, slash healthcare space that I found, Mike, was something called the Nobi. And this is from Nobi life nobi.life and uh it basically is a smart lamp uh a ceiling light if you will it gets mounted in uh, in the room and the idea behind it it has a number of features that are pretty interesting one is that it has a motion sensor so the idea is that uh and typically this seems to be geared towards seniors people living in uh care homes, uh, or just family members that want to be able to keep tabs on their elderly parents. So the idea is it's got a motion sensor. So uh, if your grandparent, for example, gets up in the middle of the night, uh, it actually will light upwards, a really soft light, sort of make the room uh, viewable, but not bright. And, and, and in that, that jarring feature when you turn on the light in the middle of the night, and you haven't quite orientated yourself to, to that light. Um, but it also has fall detection. So one of the things that you can do with that is that if grandma was to fall, for example, it would detect that she had fallen. It actually has a camera that will uh, shoot down from the ceiling and show uh, on an app for a caregiver or a family member where grandma is. Um, and, but it, what it does is it actually takes the image of grandma out of the photo and replaces it kind of what looks like a, a little animatronic skeleton uh, view like an animation of that person just to protect their privacy. Uh, so, you know, because if you fall and you're in an awkward position, it would look bad. Um, but it will then ask the person that fell, are you okay? Did you fall? And if they don't respond or they say anything other than no, then it'll alert the other person on the other end of the app, uh, whether that's a family member or a caregiver, that there's a problem. And they can actually directly talk to uh, that person through the camera system and the microphone system. So I think that's a really uh, interesting way to be able to uh, uh, sort of keep tabs on without invading their privacy, but also giving that that sort of extra sense of security that you, you're you're aware of what's going on. And if you have multiple of these smart lamps uh, in a in a in a building or whatever, the wherever the incident occurs, the other lamps will light up as well to alert you from a visual cue that there's a problem potentially and to grab your smartphone and see what the update is uh, that way. So I think it's a, it's a really uh, practical, uh, really good use of a sort of a smart assistant uh, to help uh, care for somebody uh, when you can't be there all the time. I love this technology and you know our, we've got that aging population uh, and these types of devices are going to be instrumental uh, for keeping uh, everyone uh, well and uh, healthy and you know we're even seeing these types of technology um, in Wi-Fi routers coming up I don't know if you've seen it with uh, Belkin and their Linksys routers uh, they're going to have a subscription service where your Wi-Fi router can actually um, through the waves uh, know if someone has fallen down for example and uh, you know, do the same type of uh, uh, alerts uh, as well. So we'll, uh, we'll keep on top of that. If you liked this video, please subscribe to our YouTube channel. Uh, that helps us make more videos uh, for you. Don't forget to hit the little bell icon. And if uh, you've got some thoughts on the video here, tell us what you think. Give us feedback. We'd love to hear from you.